Okay, so we now know what we're looking for and we now have all the information that we need to find it. And now we go over to this section where it says formulate and determine the solution. And remember that just means figure out a way to solve it. So some of you are gonna think of this and say, well, if she goes around twice, I know twice means two times and times is a keyword. So I can just do two times 234. And that's a math problem, isn't it? Two times 234. And some of you are gonna see it that way. Others of you are gonna say, you're gonna see a picture in your head. That's what I do a lot of times. I see pictures in my head. And so I'm gonna think, here's the path once, and here's the path twice. And then I'm gonna go back and I'm gonna write 234 on each of those because it's 234 feet each time she goes. So it doesn't matter that it doesn't look like a dog walking path, it just has to represent it. So 234 here and 234 there. And then I know I need to put those together. And putting them together is another type of problem. When you put numbers together, it's addition. So you might do 234 plus 234, okay? Some of you might just draw circles and put 200, 234 in both of those, okay? There's lots of different ways we can get to the number of feet she walked. So if I do 234 plus 234, I'm going to end up getting, and you can stop and do it if you want, stop, pause the video and do the math and then check against what we get. But you're going to get 468. But remember, that's feet. And we're not looking for 